what is going on guys and welcome back to another episode of Louisiana Outdoorsman we are once again making our way on down to the old lease on this lonely levee road because it's about the only road that's straight and smooth enough to where I can physically record this and still pay attention on the road at the same time and I have to worry about much but I tried to make a video yesterday on the you think of all days that would be good to be the opening day of the second split which could have been potentially great because we've seen hundreds of birds I mean hundreds of birds um, just right literally right outside of our decoy spread or I should, should I say shooting range because if they were right outside we could still shoot but um, just too far to, to try to shoot and we're losing all of our ducks to these pool do um, which have become a problem at this point we thought oh great if we get some pool do we'll be able to shoot a few here and there when they fly whatever they don't fly in our ponds they just move around way outside the decoys and all they do is that a deer that's a coyote <laughs> all i seen was eyes in the eyes in the road um and i thought i thought at first it might have been a deer because it was so far away and it looked pretty high but what it was is the, the coyote was up because i'm on a levee road uh, and the coyote was like halfway kind of up the levee so it looked a little bit taller than what it was anyway not to get distracted about the pool dude we thought it would have been fun if we got some pool dude and we got to shoot here and there and blah 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 and it would be fun here and there but like i said it has become a problem and all the ducks are now decoying into these pool do um our coots for you guys who aren't from louisiana and don't know what i'm talking about the american coot is what i'm talking about um it has become an issue and we need to stop it and we're gonna try to stop that today so what we have planned if the ducks continue to do what they did yesterday i know it's gonna probably hurt us in the short run but in the long run it's gonna help us we're gonna get out of the blind we actually got permission from the guys at the lease who run the lease to get out of the blind and uh track some of these pool do down and absolutely annihilate them so that was that is gonna be our plans for today we're gonna hunt for a little bit a good bit of the the morning and then after that we're gonna get out the blind and we're gonna do like a little grid march walk and we're gonna put a hurting on some coots today so if there's no ducks in this video, you guys can guarantee there's going to be a pool do slay down. So you might want to stay tuned either way because I don't know what's going to happen. So I'll catch you guys once we get in the blind, sun comes up, and banging on some birds. Stay tuned. One. We got one. Shot set. Good shot set. Little green wing I just Dude. saw him at the last minute. Last minute too. I didn't even shoot. Dude, them dudes was doing a dance. <laughs> Good shot, sir. Huh? Somebody got my ears. Somebody, somebody. Come right over. Where? Right on top of me. Oh, I see. You yeah. There's 100. No scratch. 100. Good shot, Seth. Thanks. It was there, Oh, I couldn't shoot. Seth was shooting. I only shot once. Mike must have shot because he rang the fuck on my ear. I got time to get a beat on Reds. Over here, over here. Towards up. Behind Gagan. Behind Gagan. He's flying low. He's flying super low. No way we missed that duck. No, I got oh, him. you got him. Right here, right here. You I got, got that. I two of them right here. One still up. All right, I got one right here in the grass. Seth, you go on to me. Yeah, I'm going to go. Oh, yeah, shit. Fuck we missed that duck. Oh, I killed it. He go killed it. In the grass. Landed? He got back up. I'm putting some more shells in my thing in case I need a. Uh... You better find a duck? Yeah, I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm just I didn't either. I was watching that wood duck fly super low. That's what I saw, that black duck. Alright. You want to go walk and get him? Where's he at? That duck ain't dead. No, he's not dead, but he just landed again. I heard him bad. 
as, as soon as I find. I killed two right here. I killed two blue wing right here. Two teal. Where are they? Hey, you got a beat exactly where you went? Yeah, straight. Straight that way. All right. Dude, I have no clue. That's gonna look. That's gonna look atrocious on camera. I'm gonna tell you that right now. <laughs> oh man I'm gonna go ahead and uh, apologize in advance how absolutely atrocious them shots were I don't understand how we didn't hit that teal when it came close but thank goodness Mark kind of pelayed them to the end All I gotta do is try to find this thing. Find the duck. Find the duck. Find the duck. Blue wing? It's a, that's a pretty little blue wing drake. Yeah. Don't worry. I already, I already apologized to everyone for how terrible those shots were. On y'all behalf. <laughs> I did. <laughs> oh. Well, he looks pretty. Man. I'm throwing to you. Yeah. He looks pretty. Yeah, he's nice. He is he ain't up no, not at all. Look at his neck feathers. Things are perfect. Come in, come in. My side, my side, my side, my side. I got him, yes. and Mark finished him off. I know I shot four oh, I know. I hey, saw your boy. the feathers fly when he was falling. Hey, I you thought about pulling the trigger, and I was like, hey, So no you saw, point. you saw, Mike? Yep. Hey, your boy still looking around over there. Who? That little teal? There ain't no fucking way. I'm I'm, dude, I'm telling you, when it, watch, watch if it spins. Oh, no, mine's dead now. At first, I had a head above the water, and it was just looking around. I saw the feathers fly on that motherfucker when he was starting to fall. I, as soon as I picked up my gun, I saw nothing but feathers. I was like, yeah, ain't no point in the shooting. Well, like I said, I, Mike had hit it, and then yeah. uh, I was like, oh, um, I'm gonna give it, a, I'm gonna give it a shot. <laughs> Why not? I don't, I, don't walk right there. I don't know how I missed, but them two shots didn't go nowhere. Damn! I didn't even see it again. Oh yeah, yeeted them. them. Out of these pool do told y'all we were coming for y'all y'all didn't want to believe us
told y'all we were coming for y'all. Y'all didn't want to believe us. So, we actually got permission from the the guy who runs this lease. And we told him about the problems we had with the pool dude. <laughs> and he's like, take him out. Say less, my guy. Say less. You ain't gotta tell me twice to shoot these pool dude. Don't have to tell me twice at all. I'm sure there's still more in this pond that we probably need to go shoot, but we definitely did some damage. We did some damage on them this morning. I'm coming to you! <laughs> huh? I see him. what we may have not killed all these pool dude but we're definitely making a dent at them today that's for sure that population population's getting a, a beat down for sure these are the three i just picked up we're about done i think we got maybe maybe 15 total and then we lost quite a few in the grass because when they fall in the grass unless they flapping it's so hard to see them in that rice stubble but uh, yeah, this should, even though we didn't kill a whole lot, it's only 15 of them, but they had hundreds, we still got them out of this pond. That was the main concern. And we got them into the further ponds in the back and then the northern ponds over there. Now, will not having pool dew in the pond affect the ducks? Who knows? We shall see, but that's, a, that's for another day next weekend, because, uh, your boy tired. Your boy tired, tired. All right, guys, that is gonna be a wrap on the video. I'm actually in different clothes right now because as I was editing the video, uh, I realized that I didn't even film the outro. The outro kind of got messed up with some film and stuff like that. Um, they had some error codes on certain clips. So, doing the outro now. I know the video was kind of scattered. Um, the first, I think, four clips that you guys seen, the the three teal that we killed, uh, those were a hunt. 
I guess you know the re the most recent hunt. Um, but I put the teal first, and then what I did was all the coots we shot uh, a weekend ago. I put at the end of the video because uh, everybody loves a good coot shoot, and that's how I wanted to end it off was with the coot shoot. Um, but like I said kind of mumbo jumbo of videos put together and stuff like that and random clips um but there's not much happening to be honest with you right now we are absolutely struggling for birds right now um uh, we may have to change some things around maybe have to change some decoys around i don't know what has to change the birds are kind of there but kind of not um and i say the birds are there they're not actually on the property but we see a few birds flying around here and there so it's not like there's no birds um, we just got to figure out how to get them in and, you know, how to how to make them finish up in our decoys and uh, instead of them flying around and because there's pool dew still there. They're just not technically in our pond anymore. So we've eradicated the pool dew out of our pond. They're just in other ponds, which means that the ducks are now going to those ponds and staying in those ponds. So if it's not one issue, it's another. But once again, we're going to make the best of it. I got a week coming up where I'm taking off of work for Christmas break and I'll be hunting almost every day. Um, so there should be some videos hopefully there's some videos and hopefully the birds are flying but that's for another day and another time for me to decide what's going to happen but to make sure you catch them videos you got to come back for another episode of louisiana outdoorsman